SOLIDWORKS MBD is a fantastic way to document parts and assemblies to help streamline communication between today's supply chains. And even though drawings aren't created, these documents still need to be managed. SOLIDWORKS PDM is just the tool to accomplish this. Now, SOLIDWORKS PDM has even more support for MBD. For instance, a task can now be set up to generate 3D PDFs. This task can be executed from the Actions menu in Windows Explorer or automatically as part of a workflow that gets triggered, such as upon submission for approval. The output path and 3D PDF theme is set automatically but can be changed on the fly by the user. All the 3D views in the model will be captured, and the user has the option to add additional primary views if desired. In no time at all, the new 3D PDF has been generated. A quick look into the vault reveals the new 3D PDF, complete with referencing back to the original part file. The preview window has been greatly enhanced with even better support for Office documents and 3D PDFs. Since we are now using the native Adobe Acrobat Viewer, all tools of the standalone version are available here in the preview window. MBD is a truly remarkable way to communicate design information, but many users still use 2D drawings, and SOLIDWORKS continues to add great enhancements here as well. For instance, to better communicate information in section views, you can now emphasize the outline of section parts, which makes things really stand out clearly. Detail, cropped, and broken views now have the ability to show their outlines as jagged, and the intensity of the shape can be altered to suit your needs. Now that we've made these minor cosmetic edits, we can share the drawing with the team by checking it into SOLIDWORKS PDM. If you watched the 3D Interconnect demo, you saw how this battery created in Autodesk Inventor was inserted directly into the assembly without translation. SOLIDWORKS PDM recognizes that these are native CAD files, preserves the assembly structure, and checks in these native CAD files. Since we only made minor cosmetic changes to this drawing, it is often undesirable to bump the revision. Now in SOLIDWORKS PDM, you can choose to overwrite the latest version to minimize unnecessary clutter in the vault. The native CAD files are listed in the check-in structure and are ready to be added to the vault. In addition to Autodesk Inventor, SOLIDWORKS PDM also supports PTC Creo, Siemens NX, SolidEdge, and CATIA. The SOLIDWORKS PDM vault lists the native CAD files and even keeps track of where these files are used. SOLIDWORKS PDM helps you get all of your design data under control and substantially improve the way your teams manage and collaborate to ensure everyone always has the right version. There has never been a better time to use SOLIDWORKS. With more core power and performance, SOLIDWORKS proven solutions answer your design and engineering needs. To see all the advancements in SOLIDWORKS 2017, Sign up for a launch event near you or go to mysolidworks.com. You're one place for all things SolidWorks.